Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another What I Eat In A Week Vegan. We are on the seventh vlog. I did take a break for like two weeks of vlogging what I eat in a week because I wasn't eating anything different. So this week we're gonna have something a little bit different. So I wanna show you my breakfast today. I am having, let me just spin you around. So breakfast, I've gone for something a little bit different because I'm really liking granola at the minute, but I haven't tried this granola before. I normally have a cherry bakewell one that I got from the food show, uh, BBC Good Food Show. But I thought I'd try this for a chain, fuel granola. And it's the super berry one. And I have some Aldi vegan yogurt, which is the soya one, this one here. And I put some fruit in there and some chia seeds. And I'm about to have this before I go to the gym. So a little bit of an update on uh, today's food. I had, uh, I had, I, I had a protein cookie earlier and some onion ring crisps that were like sweet chili flavour. And I've completely forgot to tell you about it. But I've had like the worst headache. So I've been in bed like on and off napping. So I'm just about to make some food. It is literally like quarter to five. And this is, this isn't even lunch because I've practically skipped lunch. But if I'm hungry later, I'll have another meal. But I'm just having some no chicken dino bites from Aldi. Best things ever. Um, and I've put some chips and some onion rings on in my air fryer because we all know i literally i'm obsessed with my air fryer and i've just tried the brand new my vegan clear vegan protein in the flavor blood orange it's freaking amazing i oh, it literally came in the post like two days ago and i was like i need to try this asap it's so nice it reminds me of like holidays in spain you know like, when you have like an orange fanta but it doesn't taste like that. It's really, really good. Mm. So that's what I'm having for food. And here is my dinner slash lunch. Don't know whether I'm going to have another one or not, but I probably will, to be honest, because I get really hungry at times. But here's my dinner. I decided to have some sweet chilli sauce with it, and I've got my multivitamin, because I really need to get back into taking my vitamins again, because there was a time where I was taking too many vitamins, and, like, my wee was, like, luminous yellow, maybe TEMI, but I had too many B vitamins in me, so I had to stop for a bit. Um, but, yeah, this is dinner. I'm just going to go right in my belly. Ooh. Hello, just thought that I'd update you. <laughs> okay, just uh, can't stand on my own two feet. I'm just eating some Plant Kitchen vegan marshmallows because I find it's most sweet and I don't really want chocolate or anything, so marshmallows it is. Evening, everyone. I completely forgot to show you what I had for lunch today, but I had a vegan Chinese, but I was at work. Um, so tonight's dinner is onion rings with some crunkle cut chips. Some Vivera, uh, what's it called, kebab style um, pieces. Leftover tennis stem broccoli. And I picked up this from Aldi. So not long come back from Aldi. It's like a kebab style wrap. And I've got some lummus to spread over it. And some spring onions. So I'll show you what I mean. It's this. This kebab wrap. Which is from Aldi. From, I think it's like 80p or something like that. And then the kebab style stuff that I have. I got reduced in Tesco, so went to Tesco as well, plant Greek style kebab, reduced from 250 to 2.5, not a massive reduction, but it was nice to have something different for dinner. Oh, I'm just going to spread this lummus, which I was kindly gifted by Tawi Foods, highly recommend this, it's literally like hummus, but like a lot less like fat and everything than calories, but it tastes pretty good. So I'm going to smother it on my wrap and then I'll show you my dinner when it's ready. And here we have it, we have a vegan gyros which I've made, as I mentioned before, with chips, onion rings, and leftover broccoli, a bit of a random one, but I put the chips inside. I'm not going to open it because it's literally going to fall apart otherwise. It's got the lummis in there, it's got the Greek style kebab, spring onions, and some chips. This is going to bring back Greece memories. Oh yes. It's just missing tzatziki, but tzatziki isn't vegan. I need to find a vegan recipe to make my own. So lummis it is for now. Good morning everyone, it's now Saturday. I've got a, a vegan fry up, so to speak. I say fry up like that because I don't actually fry it, I stick up in the oven. So I have a Aldi hash brown, some Aldi beans, Aldi vegan bacon, heck vegan meat free sausages, sourdough and some vegan cheese from Aldi as well and some vegan butter on top. And I'm very excited to get this in my belly. It looks so good. Oh, also, and I've got a blood orange my vegan protein shake you can get discount with my code it's vaseline so we're actually having lunch in creams with lizzie and i just completely forgot to show you but i'll put a picture on screen so you can see what it is but i had a vegan waffle with strawberry sorbet i think it is and some lotus biscuit spread on top with some strawberry sauce and some strawberries and it is delicious isn't it <laughs> so it's delicious isn't it and i've got a smoothie evening guys so I completely forgot to show you that we had a chippy for dinner we've actually been to asda and tesco this isn't a very nice site for you to be honest we also went to 
Starbucks and got the too good to go um thing. I was thinking of doing a video actually of like eating just too good too good to go food for a day. I think that'd be really good because it saves food waste. And the only thing I could eat was the cherry crown pastry. Everything else Adam's having because nothing else is vegan for me. So luckily there's one vegan thing in there. So yeah, that's quite good. So we've got some bits. We're gonna have a like a little treat night in front of the telly watching scream. So Oh, Bob's. See you when I'm eating some else. Oh, first time I've actually spoken to you today. And dinner is done. And this is practically all we've eaten apart from because of donuts, crisps, and banana and a pastry today. And it's well deserved because we have a shed and you can't even see it. So this is going to get right in my belly and I'll probably see you when we have some pudding. Evening everyone, it's now Monday and I'm not doing very well with the vlogging on this vlog. I hope that it's all right. Yeah, this looks like a absolute monstrosity, but I promise you it's nice. It's a vegan stir fry. I've got some leftover broccoli, one carrot, some rice noodles that we got reduced from Tesco the other night, 25p, and some vegan corn. Chucked in some sweet chilli and garlic stir fry sauce from Aldi, which is like 30 odd p. And then some vegan corn and some sweet chilli flakes. No, oh, chilli flakes, not sweet chilli flakes. And uh, yeah, this is like one of my favourite dishes, but I normally have like spinach noodles, but I've found these noodles are really cheap, so it looks a bit like a swamp. So I'm going to enjoy this. Okay, here's the exciting part of the evening. I'm going to try this naughty vegan caramel crunch cheesecake. <gasps> I literally seen those vegan guys have it. And I was like, oh my God, I need to get it myself. From what I've seen, they only sell them in Morrison's, but I could be wrong. But also, if you hear the background, I'm watching Sidemen. <laughs> <laughs> that's KSA. KSA in a strawberry outfit in the background, screaming at the game that they're playing. <laughs> but I'm now going to do the washing up whilst this defrosts, and then I'll see you tomorrow for some more food. Hi everyone, just coming on to end this video. I feel like I've completely forgot to vlog half of it. So I hope it's alright, I hope you've enjoyed it. Please do give it a big thumbs up if you have enjoyed, as much as it, it seemed like it was a mess to me. I hope you enjoyed it anyway. So I'm gonna start a new vlog, I think, of what I ate in a week. Hopefully this time I'll remember to vlog. So yeah, I will see you next time. Please do stick around, subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.